Now, for the first time in almost 500 years, people can actually walk around the renowned Abbey of St Augustine's in Canterbury, thanks to a unique collaboration between English Heritage and the University of Kent's School of Architecture. The Abbey was actually founded 1,400 years ago and is a really significant place in British Christian history. So important, in fact, that the Anglo-Saxon kings of Kent were buried there. But it was reduced to ruins in 1538 when Henry VIII ordered the dissolution of the monasteries. But now, thanks to the latest in virtual reality headsets, visitors can experience the Abbey's former glories at first hand. Robin Gibson has tonight's special report. A mixture of science, magic and a bit of a comedy moment. This is a first for English heritage, put simply a cool way of bringing the old bones of their building to life. You're pretty soon sucked into this virtual reality world. The difference here is that you're never very far away from being able to witness the real thing. It's absolutely fantastic. I mean, I'm, I'll be honest, I was a little bit dubious that they could do it justice um, when they first approached us. But the first time I tried that headset on and actually got to experience it for myself, I, I got goosebumps. It was absolutely incredible. And I think for, for many of our visitors, it's really helped them. Because the Abbey is a crucible in our history, the burial place of Anglo-Saxon kings and a keystone in the story of Christianity. It's kind of the rebirth of Christianity, uh, where St Augustine built his first abbey to, to Christianise um, England and the Anglo Saxons. And it's from here that you have a massive cultural impact. It's complicated, but virtual reality is now smoothing the vision of a complex past, a project developed by the School of Architecture at the University of Kent. The science makes the magic possible, of course. But um, it's very difficult for, if you're trying to show this on TV or on a screen, it's very difficult to get a full idea about what it's actually like. It's only once you put the headset on that you get a real idea about what the virtual reality experience brings to you. And effectively, as soon as you put this headset on, then, then you're now walking in the Abbey, which is the first time that's happened in you know, nearly 500 years. New wine in a very old bottle, set to draw a different audience to discover the story in the stones. Robin Gibson, BBC Southeast Today, Canterbury.